In this video, I'm gonna talk about play.ht. And let me start off by saying there is no complete AI substitute for a real person's voice at the moment. Now this is an evolving field and I'm sure in the next few years, the AI, vo AI voices will continue to get better and better. Um, but I've tested a, no a number of different text-to-speech softwares, SpeechLO, uh, Talkia, Lovo, and I can tell you straight away that play.ht has some of the most realistic, natural sounding voices that I've ever heard but you do have to filter through some of the robotic voices in order to find the good ones. So in this video, I'm gonna give you an overview and a review of Play.ht, the good things about it, the not so good things about it, and we're gonna take a look inside the editor and make sure to stick around to the end of the video because I'm gonna show you some, a few finished videos that I've created using Play.ht audio so you can see what they're like. So before we get into it, there's a link uh, for deals on this software in the description. I started off with a monthly plan and then jumped on the lifetime deal when that came out. The lifetime starts from $49 and there's a second link to 10% off the monthly plans if the lifetime deal expires. So here we are on the play.ht website. Like it says, it lets you instantly convert written content into audio. Now there are so many different ways you can use this. Like I mainly use it for marketing, for creating video ads, um, but you could also use it if you're a blogger, if you're a podcaster, uh, if you're creating an audio book, if you want to create video sales letters, if you want to create onboarding training videos, and there's lots of other different things as well. Obviously, when you're using this, you don't have to pay for expensive voiceover artists and wait around for the delivery of that audio. Um, and personally, I'm always tweaking and changing things, so it's really good to have that for the flexibility there. So you can see right here, you can test out the different voices for free. You can test them out right here, or you can actually sign up uh, for, for a um, free account to try out the full version to test it out for free. Um, so let's log in and um, we'll have a little look around. So as you can see, I use this quite a lot um, and I've obviously got some favorite uh, voices, but um, I'm gonna show you some of those voices in a second. But first of all, I just wanna cover the video player. Um, I don't actually use the video player, but they've got a really cool uh, player that you can actually embed it wherever you want. If you want it on your blog um, to read out your your blog posts so that people have a different way to consume your content. They've also got a really great uh, WordPress plugin that record, records a lot of those stats. So it can record like how many people are listening. Uh, and there's loads of really cool customization op options within that. So you can change how the player looks and a lot of different things. Um, just with the whole play.ht, it's just very yeah, customizationable. Just with all of play.ht, there's a lot of customization options available. So let's go into the draft section because that's where some of the short uh, audio files I've got are. And we'll start off with um, this one. And, and we'll give you, I'll show you a, um, an example of um, how it sounds like now. IPL technology or intense pulsed light weakens the hair follicle and stops hair from growing back. And it's cleared by the FDA as 100% safe and pain free. Say goodbye to shaving and waxing. Click on this video now to get 50% off your order. And so that's obviously a female voice, US English. Um, and this is one of the customization options that I find really cool. Um, some of the voices have different voice styles. So if you click on this arrow, you can actually change the voice style and they can sound very different. So I really like this cheerful one, especially for the marketing ads, because it just makes it um, seem a bit more positive and upbeat. But you can also have lots of different um, voice styles there. You can add in different pauses and you can change the um, pause duration for all your different punctuation there. Um, and you can even add in your own types of uh, pronunciation. So if they're saying something that sounds just a little bit off or a little bit funny, you can tweak it and you can change it. You can add in different ones there. And you can also change the speed. So sometimes I like to uh, increase the speed a bit and it just makes it sound a little bit more natural rather than that robotic sounding voice. Um, and here's how you just change the um, voices. So as you can see, there's lots of um, English voices here. This is just US English. Um, and you can filter by male or female if you want. So here's what um, a male US voice sounds like. Create realistic voiceover audio using the most natural sounding AI voices. So that sounds quite realistic actually. Um, and as you can see, they have lots of different languages. Um, 
one thing I just want to make note of is there's obviously lots of different languages, but if you are looking into this and you're um, wanting to use a different language, just make sure that they have enough options for you and that those options are good enough. Because like I said, there are some really good voices in here, but there are also others that are quite robotic. So if we go, for example, down to Dutch, you can see there's only three male voices and um, for female voices. So there aren't quite as many there, so just make sure that they actually sound good in the language that you want. They even have different accents as well. So I'll show you an example of a different accent here uh, in a second. And, and um, We've got like uh, English Australian, English Canadian, Indian, English Indian, and lots of different ones there. Um, and here's some of the other cool things. So this is like a key for what the voice has. So this is the multiple vo voice styles that I was talking about a second ago. Uh, some of them even have uh, a breathing function, so you can add in breathing to make it sound even more realistic, and others even have um, emphasis as well, so you can actually add in uh, emphasis to certain words to make them stand out, and again, make it sound more natural. So let's show you a couple more examples of um, some different voices. So this is a English-Australian voice. Um, I'll just play you the first couple of sentences here. I can almost guarantee that you've never seen a makeup brush like this before. And for a limited time, you can get one in your hands at no cost. It is literally the softest thing you've ever felt. So as you can see, that doesn't sound quite as nice, not as nice as flowing. I've sped that one up a little bit, um, but I'm still not 100% on that one. Um, now with all of these, like I said, nothing does compare to the real voice. Nothing really can mimic that, mimic it that well. But if you add in some background music, um, and I'll show you some videos shortly of, of with some background music, and it can really add to the effect and make it sound a lot more natural. And we've got one more I'll quickly show you. Um, and as you can see here, this has got emphasis here on this word, emphasis on this word, and this has got um, different pauses that I've added in. So if you want to add in emphasis, all you do is you highlight a word or a couple of words or a whole sentence if you want. And you, here you can, oh, this is how you can change the pronunciation. So you can um, change how it's pronounced. And this is where you can change the tone. So you can change the volume, the rate, the pitch. And with different voices, they sometimes have different options. And here is where you can add in the um, pause options as well. So if you suffer from bloating, gas, constipation, and all those wonderful things that happen to us women. Please look at the link below to see more about my story. I hope it can help you too. So that's obviously just a couple of examples um, of some different types of ads. Um, so I'll show you a few different, a couple of different videos now. Um, and these are some marketing videos that I've used PlayHT for. Um, so these are a couple of videos that I've created for businesses that they've used as ads. Uh, one's in the weight loss niche and the other is in the dating niche. I used to blame myself for my low metabolism. I was constantly craving cheap foods and feeling tired throughout the day. I wanted to change my lifestyle, but just didn't know how. That's when I discovered this strange fave food ritual. Following this odd hack helped me look and feel years younger, and my energy levels went through the roof. And the best part is, I achieved all my goals without... So this is a different example in the dating niche, and it actually uses the exact same background music. Did you know that there's a way to get your man's devotion back without playing games, manipulation, or looking desperate and needy? No matter how far you feel you've drifted apart, there's a way to leave the past in the past and start a brand new chapter with the man you love. So as you can see, they're not amazing, but they do the job when you don't want to spend a lot of money on voiceover artists. Now, I'm also going to be doing a review of the video editing software um, that I use when I've actually got all my audio from Play, Play HT to create those kinds of videos. So keep an eye out for that coming out soon. Um, and like I said, there's a link in the description for the lifetime deal that starts at $49. And if that deal expired, the second link gives you 10% off the monthly plans. Other than that, I hope you have a great day. I hope you have a great week and I'll see you in another video.